to the messy kitchen. Warning. 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 Welcome to Messy Kitchen. I'm your host, Miss G. Today we're going to be cooking vegetable soup. It's really easy to make and it's a perfect lunchtime option for you guys at home. So, let's get cooking. Whoa. Aristotle, a famous Greek philosopher, said the partridge had such a clear voice because it only ate leeks. What? Ancient Greeks and ancient Romans both believed the health benefits to eating leeks helped strengthen the throat. The ancient Roman Emperor Nero ate leeks daily to make his voice nice and strong. What? Thank you for the leek. The leak is deeply embedded in the Welsh culture. This stems from the legend of the Welsh soldiers keeping leeks in their hats to, in order to identify themselves from their enemies, the Saxons, in 640 AD. Miss G say what? Let me see what's under your hat now. Now, okay. We're safe. Be with us. In the Middle Ages, girls slept with leeks under their pillows so they would dream of their future husbands. What? <laughs> leeks are native to Central Asia. They were brought to Europe by the ancient Romans. They grew well because they could adapt to the cold weather. Ooh, yeah. The flavor of a leek is compared to an onion. Yeah, an onion. It's slightly different in that it's not as strong, but it still tastes good. Mm. <laughs> Leeks are filled with vitamins A, C and K. This is really good for our blood. Thank you, leeks. Ooh. Leeks are also filled with iron, which is really good for our red blood cells. And it's filled with magnesium, which is really good for our brain health. 
Wow! Leeks are a good source of fiber. This helps our digestive system. Woohoo! This vegetable is known as the turnip, or some people call it swede. Sounds Ooh. interesting. The turnip is a starchy root vegetable. Like the leek, it can survive cold weathers. Wow! Believe it or not, but the turnip tastes sweeter after growing during frost. <gasps> Turnips are so versatile, you can even eat their leaves. Wow. Many people think the turnip is related to the potato, but it's not. Mm -mm -mm. It's related to radish and mustard seeds. What? Turnips are sometimes grown to feed livestock, like cattle, sheep and pigs. Miss G say what? Before pumpkins were used as jack-o'-lanterns for Halloween, people carved turnips to scare away the spirits during the Celtic holiday sound. is considered a humble vegetable. This is because aristocrats used to re refuse to eat them and consider them a poor vegetable. I don't think that about you, turnip. I really don't. I think you're great, okay? It's okay. There's so much more. The heaviest turnip weighed 17.7 .7 kilograms. It was grown in Alaska in 2004. That's it for today's episode of Messy Kitchen with Miss G. I really hope you enjoyed cooking today and learning new interesting facts. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I upload weekly cookery videos for you guys at home to cook along to and to learn cool facts. Plus, I'm kind of funny, so uh, you don't want to miss that, do you? Welcome to the Messy Kitchen. Welcome to the messy kitchen